When it comes to security, Google Cloud is never finished. There's always room for improvement. And our newest security improvement is providing keyless authentication for service accounts. When your application needs to access services in Google Cloud outside of the scope of a user, it probably uses a service account. Service accounts allow developers to assign an identity to an application and then give that identity specific permissions. For example, to access a cloud storage bucket. Service account keys are akin to user passwords, allowing the holder to act as the service account and gain access to any resource that service account has access to. Unfortunately, there's no way to verify that the application holding the key has permission to use it. It's a key without an expiration date and with no guarantee around where it's stored or who has access to it. Because of this risk, managing the storage, distribution, and rotation of service account keys becomes a top priority, effectively turning an identity management problem into a secrets management problem. So what's the solution? Ditch the keys. Workload Identity Federation enables applications running outside of Google Cloud to replace long-lived service account keys with temporary credentials, also called tokens. Workload Identity Federation is a keyless application authentication mechanism for calling Google Cloud APIs. It works by first having your application authenticate to your identity provider and receive account credentials. The application can then call our security token service to exchange the account credentials issued by your identity provider for a short-lived Google Cloud access token. This access token can then be used to impersonate a service account, inheriting the permissions of that service account to access Google Cloud resources. To set up Workload Identity Federation, you'll first need to create a workload identity pool in your Google Cloud project. Fortunately, you don't need to be a super admin to do this. You only need permission to manage workload identity pools, service accounts, and IAM policies at the project level. A workload identity pool allows you to organize and manage external identities. A project can have multiple pools, with each one allowing access from a different external identity provider. This allows you to create collections of identities and easily control the permissions granted to identities from each identity provider. Then, configure a one-way trust between your identity provider and the workload identity pool by providing relevant metadata about your provider. Now, when an application attempts to exchange their IDP credential, the security token service will be able to validate that the credential is from a trusted provider before issuing an access token to the application. Finally, you'll need to create an IAM policy that allows identities in the workload identity pool to impersonate the service account. With these policies in place, we're now set up to properly authenticate the application. We've mitigated a security risk while maintaining the ability to reliably make Google Cloud API requests. To learn more about how Workload Identity Federation can help you better protect your Google Cloud access, check out the blog post. To try it out for yourself, be sure to see the documentation to start your keyless security adventure.